For more details, subscribe our channel and please hit the bell icon so you never miss an update from Top News. अरे अबीर बात अरे अरे वो अबीर ने पूरा वाट लगा दिया When I was 10 years old, I was taken to see a film. I was taken to see a film ever since my mother was pregnant. I've been watching films from her womb. Uh, and my father had passed, so I had my aunt and my mother, thin little lady, and my mom, the big Parsi lady. And the two of them, three of us, we'd go to movies every Friday. That was the day our shop was closed, where, where my mom and my aunt uh, were free. We used to watch movies every Friday, and one such movie was a film called Anand. And um, while watching the film, in the interval, I would bring the popcorns and the ice cream and the cokes. And she said, who's that actor? What's his name? So I said, that's Rajesh Khan. I said, no, no, the tall one. So I said, I said didn't you see mom on the credits? I must have been 11 years old. She said, no, go out in the lobby, go out in the lobby and check on the poster. Bring me the spelling because it's a little long and it's a little complicated for me. So I went and I phonetically tried to do something. I came back and I gobbled something and they were very upset with me because they couldn't get the name right. In the taxi on the way home, they did a stand-up routine all the way home about how to pronounce your name. So we went, Finally, the cabbie started laughing when my mom said, I got it. It's Amita Bachpan. Next, and I was so embarrassed and I was angry. Next morning over breakfast, the two of them were staring out of the window having chai and banmaska and broon. And they said, uh, let's call him my Amto. From that day on, you've always been her Amto. And many years later, I went and saw a movie on my own. When I say on my own, which means I bunked my tuition classes and watched a movie and I came home and mom was sitting like a dawn on the steps like this and I walked in and she was very upset where do you go I said to see a movie to see a movie I said yes which movie I said Amar Akbar Anthony how was my amto that, that sir is what you mean to me my family and so many people sitting here in the audience who have stories to say about how they were growing up. Young people like my wife is, can tell you stories about how she feels today. She's choking up. Don't do that, Zinovia, you're making me nervous. And more so today, when you will reveal the family name of our company, Production House, which we do in front of all of you. So everyone, may I have the clicker, please?
someone who's been a great admirer of this gentleman on my right, as someone who has had the privilege of having him with me in several of my films, of having been someone who's been upstaged by this wonderful artist in all my films. It is a great privilege today to be here at the launch of this most ambitious venture. I've always believed that the writer is one of the most, not just one of the most, he is the most important person uh, in a project. They conceive the story, they write the screenplay, they conceive the artists, how they will speak, what they will wear, where they will go, how they will perform, what dialogues they will say, all done by the writer. It's a great moment today, Bhavan, that you have decided to recognize this very important aspect in filmmaking, and my congratulations to you. There are very few of us who actually are brave enough to start something like Bhavan has. Uh, my congratulations to you, Bhavan, and to this wonderful company that you've launched. May this ever succeed. May this produce many more writers that we so desperately need and wish you all the very best. I hope to see you with me on screen again. And for God's sake, don't upstage me again. <laughs>
very humbling moment for me and very emotional. Perhaps many of you don't know, but in a few weeks from now, 15th of February, I shall be completing 50 years in the film industry. And may I, and may I just say that this wonderful wrapping around my shoulder is the best gift that I could ever have received for my 50 years. Thank you so much, Bob. I have not changed anything. I was always an actor, always will be an actor. It's just that I just found a new craft. Uh, I like I like writing ever since I've been a little uh, kid. I've been writing since I've been a little kid, but writing very badly. Uh, but over the years, I decided to learn the craft by reading books, by going and visiting uh, New York from time to time. I met. Alex over here uh, in New York, my dear friend now, like a brother, who uh, we discussed my my uh, my script. He, he was so encouraging, and over the years we remain friends. One fine day uh, he called me and says, "I'm making a tuxedo." I said, "What for?" He says, "I don't like wearing tuxedo tuxedos, but this time I'm very excited to wear a tuxedo." So he says, "I said, what for?" He calls up very excited. He said, "I've been nominated for the Oscars." So. And then next thing I know, two days later, because that party lasted for two and a half days, uh, he called up and said, we won. I said, I know, I watched television here in India. I know. And uh, the idea behind this was, when, we, when I wrote the script, uh, and I been, met with Alex, his illustrious friends from the industry that he works with, uh, I, I learned so much. And I just felt that it is wrong if just I am learning. It's important that we share. We share someone of his craft, uh, rigor, intelligence, and simplicity at the same time to come over here. And he immediately said, I would love to come. I want to see students. I want to see students. I said, but there are a lot of people um, in the industry who will hang me if they know that you came to town and you'll go away and I'll not be allowed to live in this town. So he says, so we've invited script writers who have done 10, 10 uh, successful films, 5 successful films, 4, 3, 2, and some who are waiting for their film to be commissioned. And a teacher like Anjum Rajavali is here bringing them all in. Students from FTI, the entire batch, Whistling Woods, so Xavier's X, XIC, uh, this is, you name it. So we, we got getting people from the Apple Box and we're getting people, the kids from the Apple Tree. And Alex is here to share the wonderful stories and things that I learned from him over the years in New York. Yeah, my education began with Bowman. I, one, of the, one of the humorous aspects of our relationship is that when I met Bowman, I, I, I wasn't familiar at all and didn't know who he was and hadn't seen any of his films. And I, at the same time, hadn't won any, any 
thing or didn't pay uh, a lot of attention to either. We just connected on the story that he was writing. Um, since meeting him now, I am developing a, a taste and a fascination. And what we're going to talk later about how I have a company in New York as well, where we're developing based on writers as well, which is rare as rare in the United States as it is here. Uh, the screenwriter always a little bit lower in the pecking order. Um, that's just the way it is, and I, you know, I don't know why. Um, but but we have similar uh, tastes, and discussing his story, I fell in love with his story, and that didn't take me very long to then fall in love with the man and his passion, um, and we just clicked immediately. And so it's been what four years now, or six and a half. See, that's what I do. I'm just unfamiliar and just learning. I've seen a handful of films. I've seen. Bowman's work, and now I'm opening myself up to see if we can't find a bridge. So I hope to be well versed by the next time you and I speak. Yeah. Okay, I, I grew up in, in uh, Belasis Road, uh, opposite a cinema called Alexander Cinema. It's no strange, right? Alexander Cinema was my cinema paradiso. And I used to be there every day and I knew the projection is just like that little kid. I knew Lakshman used to go, I used to watch movies sometimes from there. It was a great feeling. Alexander Cinema was owned by Ardashiri Rani, the man who uh, gave us India's first talkie, Alamara. Ardashiri Rani owned that cinema. What a coincidence that is. The name of his company, the Alamara company, was Imperial Movie Tone, a Parsi company. Adi Irani was the cameraman, Adish Irani director, producer. All the Wadia movie tones, the Hunter Wali films, uh, were from the, the, a Parsi company again called Wadia movie tone. I said, so we are going back to the basics, such as Minerva movie tone, going back to writing. I think I should go back to where, where it all began with Adish Irani, Imperial movie tone, Minerva movie tone, Wadia movie tone, and my Alexander cinema. And I decided to go the, the old fashioned way. Uh, shoot it the old-fashioned way and call it Irani movie tone, which is a very old-fashioned, forgotten way. I mean, if tomorrow we say we don't say uh, productions, we say something else. You say, well, why would they call it productions? Suppose you say Dharma production. Why would they call it Dharma production 50 years or 100 years later? Every film company was called something movie tone. So I just said, let's bring that little culture back. Let's go back to where, where we have the sweetest memories of our life in the cinema, in the dark. And it, I hope it's reflected in the movie logo that we have produced and, and shot. Well, uh, we will have that celebration on another day uh, soon. On another day, I just wanted this to be, we're putting our name out there with the message, with our message charter and mandate that this is what we want to concentrate on. We have uh, Alex who is uh, with Happy to support maybe some young writers over here. We've got a plan. We're hatching in our heads. But the first production hopefully is the one that I have written, which I've been working on. If something else comes up before that, which I which I think uh, that would be premature, maybe that. But the idea is to develop good stories. If a good story is on the page, you'll have good cinema on the screen. I think of beginnings like this. Then 20 years later, you ask me how, how far was Alex's influence. Yeah, great influence. Great influence. Thank you. Actors are our supply. The picture will be that this person for this role is correct. They don't know anything. Whoever feels right for the role. It's not got to do with friends at the end of the day. We, we are friends, but then if we don't meet, uh, we don't match on a creative level, we just be friends, which is fine. But we match on different levels. Similarly, I would love to work with all these wonderful names that you have mentioned. Thank you.
Yes. Sorry, sorry. Right. I guess. ये बहुत कुछ हुआ मेरे लिए बच बचपन के लिए हो गया मैं जब छोटा था मैं उनको देखा था तब से मैं उनको एडमायर करके आ रहा हूँ आज मेरा फैमिली का प्रोडक्शन हाउस पर इनाग्रेशन के लिए आए हैं एक दस मिनट के अंदर जवाब दिया नागपुर में इस हेडिंग शूटिंग कर रहे थे तो मतलब हम आई सेंट आउट द मैसेज अभी देखते क्या होता है दस मिनट है और यस ऑफ कोर्स नो क्वेश्चन अबाउट इट एंड इज सो हैप्पी एंड इज सो प्राउड अबाउट वी आर डूइंग दैट्स व्हाट ही सेड ऑन ऑन इट वी आर For more details subscribe our channel and please hit the bell icon so you never miss update from top news